Hello guys and welcome to Stranger to Fun Photography. Today we are going to learn about how to colorize the black and white photo with the help of Photoshop. I have taken this image from the pixabay.com and I have mentioned the link of the photo in the description box below. Let's get started with editing and colorizing the picture. Selection tool and we have to select the part of the body. You can decrease or increase the size of the selection tool by pressing alt and right side of the mouse and drag and we have to subtract if it's over selected by pressing alt and left side of the mouse this is also over selected so we have to subtract it from we have to subtract this cloth as well Okay, then we can go to the here, you and saturation, color right, then we can select a color here, skin color or near to skin color, this one, this one is okay, a little bit skin color, you can increase or decrease the lightness. can play with the saturation a little bit you can see here it's not uh, selected properly so we have got the extra part also so we have to remove this part go to the brush tool select the foreground color uh, black color and you have to paint with the black color so that the unnecessary part it will be removed from your selection tool you have to paint it with the black color so that the color extra part will be go from the selection okay now we have to paint a little bit in the finger because the finger it has we missed the finger before so select the foreground color white by pressing this and we have to paint it on the finger to get the color a little bit finger here and we have over selected in the cap so we have to reduce the part of the cap here with the color and you can switch the foreground color and the background color with the help of keyboard shortcut key x we have missed a little bit here as well so we have to Keep white foreground color and paint with brush here and this is the extra part so we have to press keyboard shortcut X to switch the background color foreground color black and then we have to paint it here okay and we have extra part here as well in the hair so we have to remove the hair as well with the foreground color black we need to paint it here as well
Okay. Here in the part of the t-shirt also we have to remove. Now we have successfully colored the skin parts and removed everything from color the skin part and you can play with the color how strong color you want and you can play with the color little bit okay with the lightness also okay and we have to remove the eye is also paint with the skin color so we have to remove the color from the eye so go to the quick selection tool and reduce the size and quick selection after that with the foreground color black with the brush paint it here ctrl d to deselect now we have colorized the black and white image to the skin color we need to go to select uh, selection tool and then you can select the part of the cloth and then hue and saturation tool Press Ctrl and 0 to centralize. Take the colorize tool here, then you can play with the hues here, whichever you want. You can choose the color among all, and you can keep any color. I'll go with this color and uh, we can clearly see here the selection is not good so we have to take the brush tool and then paint with the foreground color white you can switch the colors foreground color and background color with the keyboard circuit X so press X and then with the foreground color white color your clothes and Paint it on your clothes. We have left a little bit here, so we need to paint it here. Okay. After that, we need to make a little bit soft of the edge, so we can go to the select and mask. We can make a little bit smooth of our mask, a little bit contrast and then we can press ok with the output layer mask we can play with a little bit feather here as well if you want ok and finally this is our final product you can see the really difference between the original and the final product this is the original one with the black and white and this is the colorize photos after the colorization with the hue and saturation tool with the help of photoshop thank you so much for watching please stay tuned for more videos thank you